Hey, this is Nicholas with the Backyard Tardis here with some more adventures in locksmithing. Uh, this one, uh, a little bit of a funny story from the past. Uh, we had a lady come in and she had a safe that uh, uh, belonged to her father. And she was desperate to find some paperwork that uh, uh, she needed for uh, being the executor of his estate and going through and trying to make get all the, you know, I's dotted, T's crossed, and all that. And she was confident it was in this safe. And it was a fairly cheap safe. And so, um, you know, she didn't care if the safe was okay. And we're like, well, you know, it, it's pretty expensive for us to open a safe. Uh, in fact, uh, usually our base, no matter what kind of, except for like a little document safe that's opened by a key, um, if it's got a dial, uh, our base price is $350. Now, there are safes that don't even cost $350, but the effort to open it so that it still functions and do it all the right way is expensive and time-consuming. But uh, if they just want one of these cheaper safes open, uh, we can usually get it open in 10, 15 minutes destructively. Uh, even safes that look big and impressive, a lot of times... Um, if they're a cheaper safe, they're they're not that hard to uh, get open. And maybe I'll talk about that in an, a, another video. But uh, so anyways, she asked us to do this. And, you know, so we get it open. And there's no paperwork inside. But uh, instead, there's a collection of women's underwear. And we had to go tell this lady that that's what's in the safe. And at first, she didn't believe us. And this wasn't a young lady. This is an older lady. So this is her aged father, who, you know, she thought she knew. And she goes in, she looks at that, and, and she is just... The rage and embarrassment on her face. And she stormed out. She left the safe there. We ended up calling her and throwing it out, but it just completely, um, yeah, uh, last thing she would have expected uh, to find in there. So, you know, it just goes to show you whatever whatever thing you have when you die, it, it gets exposed. So, but uh, we, we've had a number of customers come in and we'll jokingly sometimes tell them, well, you know, We'll we'll open it for free if we get we get half rights to everything inside it. Uh, if somebody has like a mystery safe that they inherited, they don't know what's in it. Uh, but uh, it's always a gamble that we get a lot of calls for that with people uh, after a family member dies, they want to get into the safe. So another lesson you can take from that: if you have family and you're putting together your will and testament and all that, put the safe combo there. Uh, put the location of all the necessary paperwork, g give that to your kids or to whoever you have in charge of your estate, uh, because that becomes an issue. Anyways, uh, just thought I'd share that funny experience. Uh, that's just, uh, another day with adventures in locksmithing. Hope everybody's having a good day and I'll catch you in the next video.